Hello, my name is Jennifer, and welcome to part 87 of the Foster Child Challenge. And if you are returning, welcome back. And I don't remember exactly where we are. I think it's pretty close to where we left off last time. And I am finally recording after the game update. But before we have Nicholas join the freelancer career, little um, Connor is energized. So that's a perfect time for him to work on his movement skills. So we're going to ask to play. He's a little angry because he uh, is frustrated with words from trying to learn how to talk. And I know that at one point Nicholas was angry because Connor was being defiant, which is why I thought I would have Connor ask instead of Nicholas. So that hopefully that would, um, <laughs> we wouldn't get any defiance from it. So he's busy playing. I did ask Noah to earn a high score. Well, that did not work. I must need to put some stuff on the table so that they stop coming. That is sort of, the kids will go and use the drawing tables if there's nothing on them. So I probably took it off because I wanted him to draw, but now I don't want him to draw. I actually want him to play keyboard commander. So come back, come back, Noah, and uh, play keyboard commander so that you can earn your high score on the typing game. And Jasmine needs to still practice more lines for her, her um, learn new lines for the drama club. Because it says right here, because she's a line learner, and she needs to learn new lines by either using a mirror or by selecting the sim. And she's only half done. So an elderly sim asks Maya if she wants to listen to some of her favorite music from her childhood. Well, we're going to listen to the music. I find that often works, but not guaranteed. Yay, she learned a bit about the piano and she gained some manners. So that worked out well. So with uh, Jasmine here, <laughs> let me get the names right. She is on vacation because she, I don't want her to go to school. I want her to stay home and work on the various things she needs to do. But I was kind of hoping she'd get to level three of the drama club. But I don't know how likely that is that she's going to get to level three of the drama club. Because one of my goals with this, or one of my things that I've said, is that they need to complete the first two tiers of their actual rolled aspiration. And I use the randomizer from the legacy challenge to do that. And... I don't mind if she gets them right after. So becoming an adult and joining an acting, the acting career, that's fine because she can do that immediately when she ages up. But earning a gold in a commercial acting gig, she can't do that as a teen. She would have to, if we we're going to say she can't leave the house to make a space, which is another way I could just do it. We can say she has to go in the acting career and you can do that. Maybe, but I also said that or they can do a level, like get max out a career and scouting is actually considered a career and she has maxed that. But I was thinking since she actually wants to be an actress that she might need to give a street and actually, um, you know, get somewhere in the drama club as opposed to just in general. But let's go on, <laughs> check on the toddlers. So she needs to go potty a little bit. So you should, oh, and it looks like the potty chairs are all dirty. No one has cleaned them. Evie? Did I send you out there to work on, uh, maybe, you probably did. But you're going to come over here and you're going to come and clean up. And when you're done cleaning up, you can actually collect a bunch of badges. I see that you have some. You have arts and crafts. You have civic responsibility. You have young scientist. Uh, scholarly aptitude. And outdoor adventurer. So you still need to do the keep fit, which is easy enough to do as a teen. Uh, good deeds, which we'll have to work on. That's one requires a little bit of work. Um, give back badge, which we just need to do some donating. And the sociability, she needs to talk a little bit more <laughs> to Sims to get that one. And that's what she needs to do. So, and the garbage one, if she actually took the garbage out, that would help. But that's her, her cue is, you know what, let's skip these for now. Let's skip those. So you, I wanted you to go potty. So you're going to go ask for potty help from Lacey. And then you are playing your Energize still. But you need to go potty too. So why don't you ask for potty help from Nicholas there. 
And did you finish your lines? Did you? You did. Good. So she needs to work on her emotional control and her empathy. Oh, look. Noah completed his aspirations. So for her emotional control, let's actually have her work on her empathy first. We're going to have her volunteer because that's a good way to work on empathy. And she can volunteer at a soup kitchen. There's a chance she might learn some cooking skill from that. Oh, and she's uncomfortable. Oh, there's a nanny, the butler cleaning up. Hopefully that goes away. <laughs> uh, yeah, in some ways having a butler in this house is not really very useful because the kids need to be doing some of the things that the butler is doing. <laughs> like for the scouts, it makes it harder. So you, my boy, you have actually finished that. So you don't need to be on rambunctious scamp anymore. Social, you need to make a best friend forever. So I need you and, and Evie to talk to each other to be, so that you can, guys can become best friends forever. And you have over 2,000 points. So we're going to go in here and get you incredibly friendly, assuming I have not. No, I've already, you have a lot of points. <laughs> I have to say, you have a lot of points given that you already have purchased that incredibly friendly trait. So you're not doing anything. So why don't you come over here? Can you empty that? No, the, the, we already got emptied. We're going to come over here and we're going to talk to, this will help her with your sociability badge and it will help make them become better friends. And you don't need to do that anymore. You need to talk. You need to both make a best friend forever. And I know I can have them make it with the nanny, but I'd rather not. I'd rather them actually make a best friend. And so I think becoming best friends with each other when they kind of were raised in the house together at the same time kind of makes some sense. So we're going to make some funny faces. We're going to discuss interest. And you're back. What about you? You need to have a shower. Why don't you come over here and just take a thoughtful one? Because that's, you know, <laughs> what I usually have them do. That may not be the best thing, but we'll see. And you need to, you've already done the first two. These things are actually things that you don't need to do because you only need to get two of them done. So you need to work on your empathy some more and your emotional control. So why don't you, after you have your shower, why don't you write in your journal? Is that in here? You're going to write in journal. I don't know if I ever gave the little, the younger ones journals when they aged up. No, 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 no. I don't want you to go on the monkey bars. You don't need to go on the monkey bars. It's of no use whatsoever because you've already maxed your motor skill. I mean, I guess not no use because that helps with the get fit, with the, the badge for getting fit. It can help a little bit. But maybe you guys could come dance together. Why don't you come? Well, I don't know if we can really have you dance together. We're going to turn on backyard and then you're going to come and dance. And then you can come and dance. And I don't know that you're going to be dancing together because I don't want to do dance together because that means everybody else too. But you, did you go potty? Did you ever actually get help with potty? No. <laughs> no, you didn't go potty. So potty help now. We're just going to ask Lacey because she's right there. And you, you're going outside. No, you don't need to go outside. You can come grab this last serving of the steak dinner. And then you may as well make some more food so that it doesn't go bad. We're going to cook a something, <laughs> something tasty that will fill up the toddlers. I'm not using fresh ingredients. I just never do. I um, have found that if they're only normal quality, sometimes the food won't turn out very well. We're going to add filler ingredients and finger cross. It works. Yay! The soup is even better than before. So she gained responsibility for asking for help. She didn't learn any cooking, but that's all right. She can learn that herself at home. That's not that big of a deal. It's pretty easy with the traits they get that they, they really go up pretty quickly, especially the first levels of it. And then he needs to kind of have a shower. So we're going to have you take a thoughtful shower. Oh, you were thinking about a family member. And we're going to put this. It's excellent. We're going to put this over here. Does he not have the stoves and grill master trait? I would have thought I would have got, yeah, he does. I'll have to keep an eye and see whether or not any of his food is impeccable because that's something that can happen. This was, uh, there was one. I don't know how long it's been there for because he has the fresh trait, fresh chef trait. So she is, 
is working on that, Saren, and, you know, you're kind of tired, and you didn't really eat very much, my dear. But what you're going to do is you're going to come over here, and you're going to have a bedtime story from Lacey, because Lacey looks like she's done. You don't need to be playing with those. You need to be going to bed, because you're tired. And you, did you finish? You're going to come, and you're going to actually, no, you're not going to rally the troops with her, because that might interfere. And he's busy. You're not... You're not that bad, and you're on vacation. Good, that's what I want. So you're actually going to go volunteer again. And you're going to do a fight disease this time. There you go. Off you go. So that we can get you, we can get you out of the house. Because you've done, you got your A. You've done your first two tiers of your aspiration. So right now, all we need for her is to get her emotional control and her empathy up. So we can just go back and forth between those two things. And also will help her reputation, which we don't actually need. But, you know, it'll just be a thing. Her cooking is two. She can probably make... I like their cooking to be three before they leave. So Jasmine is back. And how are your needs? <laughs> she has a pristine, pristine reputation. And we're going to come over here and we're going to rally the troops. Because he's out of the shower, and then she needs some more emotional control. She needs more empathy, mind you. So why doesn't she go out again to volunteer as soon as she finishes with um, rallying the troops? And this time she can go, uh, she can go walk, walk to fight disease. Also, are you actually doing what I asked you to do? Are you going to read? I hope so. Okay, it looks like you are. So let's check in on Connor. He's eating. So you can talk to stranger. And babble. And... Can you talk to stranger? I can't seem to do anything with Oliver anymore. Uh, talk about favorite color. I can't seem to click on Oliver. It is Oliver, right? Yeah. Oh, crazy. Yeah, see, because Oliver I took out of the left. It. I brought, removed him from the house in order to bring the new toddlers in. But it's odd that he could babble. Or he could talk to Stranger, but now he can't do anything with him. Interesting. So you're going to, you need to actually eat, my dear. You need to finish eating so that you can go to bed. So while you're doing that, we're going to have him find a job. I know he's self-employed, but we're going to try and, instead of being self-employed, we're going to try and become a freelancer in the writing career for him. So we're going to go down here and freelancer. I'm not sure why those, sure why those are showing as new because I have done them. So we're going to do that. So now we need it to get the pop up. There we go. And we're going to do uh, fighting words, trade freelance writer. And one of the things I also like about this is that you can unlock the laptop, which of course we can get a laptop because I have Strangerville, but you can get the laptop that's specific. It is in the base game and comes with that career. So he has done that, but I'm not There's no point in him looking for a gig right now, even though I'm pretty sure he's maxed his writing skill, which is why I thought I would have him go in that career. I don't know that he's actually, no, he's actually completed that aspiration. We'll leave him on the <laughs> the aspiration he's on, even though he can't do anything. Okay, now that you've done that and he's finished eating, you're going to take him and you're going to hopefully read Connor to sleep because Connor needs to go to sleep. He's very, very, very tired. And Noah, you're going out to play there. So you still, and where are you, Evie? Can you guys become best friends forever yet? Can you discuss interests? And, um, we can joke about, oh, it was there. I missed it. But it's still there. It doesn't matter that I missed it. It just means I need to go find it now. <laughs> so it was right there as a top level thing. Yay, they can become best friends forever. Perfect. Another sim keeps edging up and purposely staying in front of Maya. Oh, yeah, they want to race. What should she do? We're going to ignore the sim. It's not a race against others, it's a race against oneself. Maya realizes this and angrily glares the other sim down. She looks embarrassed and refuses to look Maya in the eye again. Maybe her response was a little harsh. Well, I said ignore the sim. <laughs> angrily glaring her down, is or he, him or her down. It was a she. It's not ignoring her. Anyways, that's all I said. I said to ignore her. 
So hopefully they become best friends forever soon. I thought they were on vacation. Why is it saying to go to school when they're on vacation? Maybe it just does that. They all have that. They're all on vacation. So come be, come be, um, best friends forever. And then we're going to do more social things. Now, do you have the incredibly friendly trait? Yes, she does. I think it was Blake I checked. <laughs> I'm going to ask about the scouting career. And that means now they need to, she needs to max her social, but she needs to become friends with three kids and friends with two adults, as does Blake. But he has maxed his social skill already. So now we're going to go over here and try and, uh, hmm. We're going to ignore the Sim. Ja a Sim walks up to Jasmine and tries to go Jasmine into ditching the walk to play a game with him. What should she do? We're going to ignore him because I don't think ditching the walk is a good idea. Oh no, she tries to ignore the Sim, but the Sim keeps battering her. She loses her cool and snaps the Sim. The Sim looks really oh, hurt by Jasmine's harsh words. So did she lose uh, uh, manners? She lost emotional control. <laughs> and what did, uh, what did, she lost empathy. <laughs> oh well. So we're going to collect a badge. We're going to collect their scientist badge and our sociability and our scholarly aptitude and... Okay. Yeah, thank, thank you. I've never had that because I've always called right away. <laughs> I've never had that pop up. <laughs> okay. We are going to ask other kids if we can join in and she, she can work. Okay. We don't want a gig right now. Thank you. <laughs> we'll do that soon, okay? We're we're already we're in the middle of like stuff. Thank you. The whole point of this is that we can do it at our leisure, not having people hara harass us. Thank you very much. Okay, you don't need to make a drink. This is the time to get a gig because if you finished, both the little ones are sleeping, so you have the ability to come here and check for gigs. Now we'll do this. So. He is level 10, so he could write, do breaking into the crime genre. Is there anything that's like level 10 or is not? Oh, no. Biogra We're going to do this one. Biographical publishing firm hiring, and the pay is 4730 It's Friday at 10, and it's due by Monday at 9. If you do get it done earlier, then you will make more money. You get paid a bonus. So Biograph is hiring a temp position for their publishing department. We want someone to help construct family trees and put their life stories to word for our catalogs. If you like untangling family tree branches, talk to us. So we need to chat with a client, with the client. We're going to have him do that just to start with. And then I'm going to check in on Noah and see. So they need some manners and conflict resolution worked on. So... You're playful. Why did you have a bath? I don't like it when the Sims have baths. <laughs> I wish they'd have showers. I like to have the bathtubs in the house because I like them to be available for when I want them to have a bath, but I don't want them to go do it on their own. Thank you very much. And when does she work? I could have her go into the, um, the painting freelance also. But I haven't yet. Oh, that must be all the the badges she's getting he's getting is there any are there any kids around or is because it's school day no one's around we may have to take them to the park to be able to complete that part of their aspiration because i do find kids if you go after school there's a lot of kids hanging out at the parks so you're going to come over here and you're going to do a friendly introduction Chupa. you don't need to go do what you were doing Chupa. you need to keep working work 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 <laughs> get everything done come over here and do this. Oh, and it's hot out. So we got the first one done for Noah. I don't look like he got all of them. Collect. Oh, he has them all. Okay, so he needs some more arts and craft, which means he hasn't obviously done his arts and craft, his creativity. So he has to draw all of the pictures. He has not done any of them. But he's only level seven of creativity. So we're going to draw an animal. And I'm trying to find somewhere to put these pictures. 
Okay, just you can just take it. You can take the picture because we can. Uh, we got pictures from past kids. Because you're gonna need one, two, three, four, five, five tables. So we're gonna draw, and I'd usually do these alphabetically. But obviously, he doesn't have the monster unlock, so we'll just do that at the end when it should unlock. Okay. Oops, I didn't, did, did she? I didn't actually mean to click that. And he's busy. She's busy. You, you may as well go do some painting for your job. Because it says that you need to do some painting before you go to work. So just do a painting. And then Maya, you need some fun, actually. So why don't you come over here and write, no, write, play game, play Play Blick Block, and hopefully that'll stop you from asking the advice that you were about to ask, <laughs> which might have messed something up that I didn't want. Okay, then you're going to clubs, rally the troops, and we're going to check in on Jasmine. Oh, and she probably, she could probably go volunteering right away because she should be home. But before she volunteers, we're going to actually have, uh, she probably shouldn't. She needs some fun. Clubs, club gatherings, rally the troops. Is there anything she can do? Oh, you know what she can do that's fun? Where is a violin? Where is a violin there? That's a kid's one. Where is an adult violin? We have a lot of kids' violins. <laughs> Did I send the adult violins on? Oh, there's one. But we're not going to do it in there because there's toddlers sleeping. You're going to come over here and play with emotion because that will help your fun and that will also help your emotional control. So we can do two things at once. Yay. And that's because she's level, least level four of violin skill, which is one of the reasons I like to work on that. And the reason I also like to do violin versus the other instruments is because with the play with emotion with the violin, uh, they can just do it forever and ever and ever. Whereas with the piano and the guitar, they will like just do like a session of it and then they stop and you have to set them up again. Whereas with, like I said, with the, the uh, violin, they'll just keep doing it, which is the plus of it. And she needs, uh, but she needed fun. I was going to send her out for more volunteering, but I decided she needed to have some fun. So it was better to just keep her home and then she'll go out at the end of the day to the uh, drama club, which I'll need to remember to send some people because she'll be sad if she does not get anybody to go with her. Now, did she make friends with that person? She did. She made friends with him. Oh, and here's someone else. So we can come and introduce ourselves to Bob Pancakes and make a friend with an, another adult. So she's got two parts of her aspiration. Well, one part of that. One of the three parts, that is what I mean to say. Not two. So she became good friends. So she's got that done. And that helped her, her um, manners. And she's maxed her social skills. So now she does have two of three parts done. Yay. And friendly. You can ask for typing tips. Talk about some grilled cheese. And then you know what, my dear? You're going to go home. Because you need... There's no one here. And luckily he doesn't mind you because you became friends with him. He, otherwise you might be a bit tense. Loners don't mind Sims they're friends with. They get tense if they're around Sims that they are not friendly with. So you're going to go home and you're cooking. Toddlers are still sleeping. Just quickly. Oh, Lacey's spotlight is fading. So you need to probably go sell that painting. Sell to collector because it's not a masterpiece and so it won't give her fame. And this is Nicholas's. That's Lacey's too. So we're going to sell it to the collector also to help her. But... We're going to leave this part here. We, you know, we worked a little bit with the toddlers at the beginning. We worked with the kids on their aspirations. And, of course, the uh, teens, they did a lot of working on their character values in order to help us hopefully age them up. Because especially with our uh, Maya, she that's all she needs to do. She needs to get those worked on. So, and then once she's finished, she we can age her up and out of here because she is an A student and she's done everything she needs in my goals apart from getting those uh, emotional values up. So that'll be probably a focus in the next part. Oh, yes, of course, we added uh, Nicholas to the freelance career. So he still needs to work on that a little bit. All he did was chat with the clients and now he needs to write a biography. But we'll get to that in the next part. But that's going to be it for this part. Thanks very much for watching and we'll see you next time. 
Bye. This has been Jennifer. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below. I'd love to see them. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more videos of challenge Let's Plays, tutorials, and occasional speed builds, please subscribe if you haven't already done so. Thanks very much.